cut payments to hospitals for more than four months. Some of the teachers are now forced to pay hospital costs from their own pocket. SKTN's Willie Lusigi with more. A school teacher is a heartbroken man. He has been denied treatment services at a number of hospitals in Western Kenya since the beginning of this year. Today he has been turned away by one of the hospitals due to failure by the official teacher's health insurance provider, Medical Administrator Kenya Limited, MAKL, to disburse funds to hospitals for a period of more than four months. Unambiwa kwamba your facility does not offer the service because... Uh, while uh, contractors were made delay kulipa the owners. In Vihiga County, it is a similar situation. Teachers are being forced to pay for their costs if bills exceed more than 1,000 shillings. They only tested me for malaria, and they told me there's another test I was to undergo, but uh, I had to pay for it cash. Hospitals are accusing the insurer of failing to pay when teachers are admitted to various hospitals. In some cases, they claim the insurer fails to meet even outpatient bills. MKL have diminished their payment up to only 850 per client or per, per patient. When a teacher comes and you, you, you prioritize, the, 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 the prioritizer is, is, is rejected. What do you do? Tell the teacher to go back home or to pay. And you see the teachers are... Like rioting, why are, why are we telling them to pay and yet they are in, 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 in insurance? Mrs. Millicent Cheng is another example of a teacher who was forced to part her life savings to pay for a surgery of more than 100,000 Kenyan shillings. The services are good. The only problem is when now paying, upon the discharge you are told it has been rejected, so you pay cash. But when reached for a comment, the insurer through Talasho Jing said it was addressing the issue with the individual hospitals and will be releasing payment plans soon. Ojing requested hospitals not to turn away sick teachers as their demands will be fully met. The payment of January and February Now, getting the, of, of, of drugs, payment of services to our Clinicians is becoming a problem to us. Teachers are currently being deducted about Kenyan shillings 2,000 monthly to cater for their medical insurance and NHIF. I pay two insurance schemes. It doesn't make sense at all because that is like robbery. This is the latest controversy in the 15 billion shillings medical insurance scheme and country's second largest medical scheme. The TSA has to come out clean. On this. Teachers are now calling on the government to ensure that they get better health care services, especially during this time of COVID-19 pandemic. Will Sigekete News, Kakamega. Tonight's police based at Kayole Police Station here in Nairobi are investigating a case in which some seven suspects are being held in connection with alleged kidnapping. The suspects